Space Explorers Between the Lines. Three, two, one, go! Last match of the day, folks, for Saturday. Already we've got four or six robots moving through the sandstorm. Redemption for number 11. Mort trying to line up with the cargo bay. No one quite scores on the cargo ship before the sandstorm goes up. 35-15, the Nubotic Mustangs dropping down the cargo into the Blue Alliance sh ship. Two points separating these alliances right now. This is critical for Team 2590 on the Blue Alliance. Currently sitting number one. They got to get as many ranking points out of this one as possible. But teams like Rox Botics, 4361 on the Red Alliance, and their partners continuing to unload on that cargo ship, widening the gap 22 to 15 with 100 seconds remaining. 40 35. Over for the Blue Alliance. Looks to be taking a defensive position. Rox Botics, though, going one for one in the cargo ship. This ain't a scene, it's a cargo race right now. Red Alliance has the lead, 10 point differential. Just over a minute remaining in this last match of the day. Thirty-five, fifteen. the Pneumotic Mustangs for blue. They've got cargo in their hold. 2590 also has a strong hold of their own cargo. Dropping one off. Looks like the cargo ship is the main point of interest right now. There's a first frenzy going on. 50 seconds remaining. Mort for the Red Alliance looks to be going for either another hatch or the have. Their partners, Rock Spotics, going up for level two. Can we get a triple play on that platform? We'll see with just over 30 left. Oh my, 2590 trying to get hold of a hatch panel, not quite making it. Here it comes, the race for the Hab, trying to get those extra points. 30 to 21 with 13 seconds. Who's going for level two? Who's calling it quits at level one? Seven seconds remaining. Mort up against the blue rocket. 40-35 taking advantage as time runs out. <laughs> 